Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome to topic 2.1, creating a new company data file. Okay, so I believe that uh, you save the file or the folder in your USB pen drive. Okay, so now I want to uh, create a shortcut for the program so that each time when you open your uh, pen drive, okay, you can see the exe file so that uh, you can easily click it. Okay, you don't have to each time find the file. Okay, so how to do it? Okay, find the myopbp myopp.exe. Okay, single click, right click. Okay. Use your right click, right click on your mouse. Mouse, sorry. <laughs> okay, now click create shortcut. Okay, when you click shortcut, okay, there will be a file. Okay, uh, there will be a file name as shortcut. Right? Okay, now single click this file. And then click and drag this file to USB. Okay. Alright, now you can see the file over here. Okay, if you can't do it, okay, pause this video or you can uh, repeat this video and then try to do it. By this time, everybody have the same uh, environment like myself. Okay, now double click. Okay, this window will appear. Okay, so each time this video appear, you need to press yes. Okay, okay, now this exercise we want to create a new file. Before we create a new file, Okay, let me uh, explain a few things. Alright. So, before you can start using Myop Premier to record the accounting entries or account transaction, you must first create the company data file. So, how to create a data file? You click create. Okay. Right. When you click create, and this is the um, this environment or this window, okay. From now on towards uh, uh, the end, okay. Sometimes it will be asked in the test, uh, the common test, and final exam. So uh, take a uh, take note or pay attention. Okay, it's it there. Welcome to Myop New Company File Assistant. The new company file assistant is designed to get you up and running in the minute. To create a company file, all of you, all you have to do is simply tell us about your company. Answer a few questions regarding your accounting year and choose your accounts list. Okay, so what you should do is click next. Okay, now. According to your, what we call that, uh, your, your uh, guidance, uh, or we call it as a manual, okay, you need to create this. So, open up your manual, okay, and then we want to do this exercise, alright? Okay, we leave the serial number because this is a trial version. Your company name will be your name. Okay, will be your name. And uh, this exercise is in Computerized Accounting Study Guide, uh, page 10 onwards. Yeah, okay, page 10 onwards. Okay, so the company name is your name. Let's say your name is Ahmad. Ahmad Sessionary okay, Enterprise Alright 
company number you can skip this one sales tax number you can skip this one okay and address address you can type uitm okay pahang okay 2646 26400 okay that is triple zero already ha bandar jengka okay pahang okay the phone number is your phone number okay let's say 019 9 Two, three, six, five, 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 five. Let's say, okay. Your fax number is uh, we create ah uh, zero nine four six zero two double one six. Okay. Email number is your email. So it will be Ahmad. Okay. Gmail. Dot com. Okay. For you, your phone. Your, your own email number lah. For phone number also is your phone number. Okay. You don't need to copy me. Alright. So. If okay. Click. Oh company number. Should not be blank. Okay. We put company number as your name. Okay. Alright, so I need you to take uh, one minute or two to read this. Alright, so tell us about your accounting year. Okay, let's say, okay, the current financial year, okay, is 2009. Okay, that is the current uh, year. And then the last month for financial year, okay, in this exercise is June. Okay, so conversion month means the month that you will continue to use myop as your accounting system. Alright. So, we know that one in a year, there are 12 months. But, okay, in accounting, we need the 30th month, yeah, to make adjustment. Okay. Why we need 13, 13 months? Because after the account close, there are other adjustment that we need to to do the adjustment like uh, depreciation the the accruals uh, and so on okay uh, so we choose 13 okay all right so next okay now let's review is it according to the uh, the the question uh, the the guidance okay it is two thousand nine the conversion uh, the the current month is June the last month sorry June the conversion month okay the conversion month is first July oh okay let's go back all right correct yeah okay um. The conversion month is July. Okay. The conversion month is July. And uh, that's it. Okay. Now click next. Alright. So there are three scenarios here. Okay. Build your account list. Okay, if you did not know what is charts of accounts or account list, please pause this video and have a look in 
your Google or Google it. Okay. Alright, by this time you know what is charts of account and what is account list. Okay, every company file require an accounting list. Account list. You may either select one of ours or you can use your own. How would you like to build your own list? Your account list. Select the option that most fits your needs. Okay. So number one, I would like to start with one of these provided by my yop. Okay, this uh, this means that uh, there is a scenario or type of uh, company that will be listed by my yop, and you just choose one. Okay, normally it is a bit difficult to find exactly what uh, provided by my yop and need by us. Alright, number two, I would like to import a list accounts provided by my accountants after I'm done creating my company file. This is for advanced user actually. Okay, but if you are a student and you want to learn, okay, choose the third one. I would like to build my own accounts list once I begin using my York Premier. So there, there will be um, suggestions and then you can amend or delete or create a new one. Alright, so we choose this option. Option number three. Next. Okay, now. Create your company file. Your new company file will automatically automatically be named the name the same as your company name. This file will be saved in the same location as your MyOp uh, Premier Program. This means that it will save in the folder of your MyOp Premier. We don't want that. Very difficult to find because there are many other files. So we change it. We change where? We change in the folder. Okay. In the folder, in your pen drive folder. Okay. Find your pen drive folder or USB drive. Double click. Okay. And we save here. Okay. Make sure it is USB drive. Okay. Your company, Ahmad Search General Enterprise. And then, uh, so it's not Ahmad, it's your name. Okay, this is a uh, contoh Ahmad. And then click, okay, click save. Okay, all right. If you click save, all right. So it become E. This is your uh, USB drive, Ahmad Sessional Enterprise. Okay, then you click next. Okay, now MyOp will process your your file. Okay, it takes a few seconds. All right. Okay, now congratulations, you become a MyOp customer. That's all there. That's all there is to it. <laughs> your company file has been created. So. You can click Setup Assistant or straight away go to Command Center. Okay, now guys, click Command Center. And then, that's it. Okay. Uh, this is uh, what we call that. Uh, Command Center for, for my app that you set up just now. Okay, I, I, I adjust the screen a little bit. Okay. All right. Okay, thank you. That's all for topic 2.1. See you in topic 2.2. Thank you.